Hi guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can change the assistive touch shortcut menu on your iPhone 13 series. First, let's go back to the home screen by swiping up at the bottom of the screen. And you can see that if I tap on the assistive touch, this is the default menu. So let's see how we can change some of this shortcut. So first, let's go to settings. So on the home screen, tap on settings. And in settings, go down and we're going to tap on accessibility. Then go down and tap on touch. Then tap on assistive touch. And then in here, go down and tap on customize top level menu. Then in here, if you want to replace an icon, uh, you can say so if you want to remove control center and replace it with something else, you tap on it. And in here, let's say you want to open camera instead. So you choose a new system function that you want to open. So camera and then tap on done. And now we have replaced control center with camera. Okay, as for notification center, if you do not use notification center because you can simply just pull down on your left hand side. So you can tap on that and then replace it with either uh, double tap or gestures, hold and drag, lock rotation, or using it at a mute button to immediately mute the volume, or simply restart your device, or take a screenshot, then tap on done, and that's it. So now uh, if you open up the assistive touch menu, you can see the shortcut has been replaced with shortcut and camera. So that is quite straightforward. Now you can add in some additional um, shortcut as well. By default, the shortcut have the shortcut menu have six icons. You can add in an additional two more icons. So you can have the maximum of eight icons in here. And you can see as soon as I add, I tap on the add button, two additional box added to the menu. So just simply tap on the add button and in here select a shortcut that you want uh, to use. For example, you can choose it to open notes if you like to take notes quite often or open music if you like to um, use it to open up your music app or torch. And then this one here, we can tap on it to add in torch. Okay, so somewhere in here, torch. And then tap on done. And now you can see we have two more additional shortcuts that we can use. And uh, at, any, at any point in time later on, if you want to reset it, you can tap on the reset button and this will reset your assistive touch menu back to the default. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.